say, he was caught in, um, she said, like a plant or part of the fence. Um, he's obviously been scraping really hard to try and get out. Both his legs are red raw yeah. where he's been rubbing. Um, what we need to do is we'll get him out, we'll give him a quick anaesthetic so that we can have a really proper look at his neck. So. His gums are nice and pink. He hasn't damaged any of his mouth, which is a really good sign. So keep him on that. What I'm gonna do now is tube him because I'm gonna to have to get all round that neck. Yeah. Lift her lift her head right up for me. I don't know why I shut one eye when I do that, but I always do. What I'll need to do is take all the hair away, um, give it a really good clean, and then we just treat the skin for probably about a week. Hopefully that's all it's gonna take. Um, and we need to put something soothing on it today um, and something to avoid flies going near him as well, because that's a worry. But I'm quite hopeful that, that she's gonna be okay. The whole of that chin is really sore. And she's got mud and all sorts in it. that while you're doing that yeah one. give it a really good scrub and then I'll dry it and try and clip a bit more of the hair off and this is the sort of area that I'm concerned about is this is the constriction injury that I was sort of mentioning before the the tissue could be dead in this area and if it's dead then that whole like, section there will break away and break down and of course you've got her windpipe mm. and everything underneath there it's a, a real worry but let's hope for the best. Just trying to make an estimate of what this has cost us just so far. Um, the anaesthetic, the drugs that we've given, the tube of drug that I used the whole amount to try and get her better. On top of that, we've got a provider with food. She'll be here for a good few weeks. I mean, you're talking probably 150, 200 pounds just to give her a chance and with no government funding, with no lottery funding. We rely on people like you who are watching this to help her. So send us some money, please, please help her. <laughs>